Dan Moskal here, and in this video we are going to create a Facebook business page. We're working with a local business and we've been working on her website. She's a mental health therapist in the Columbia, South Carolina area, and we are, this is her website right here, we are going to create her a Facebook business page. So uh, you can do this a bunch of different ways, but we're just going to go ahead and do it this way. We're going to go to the create a page within Facebook and on a side note if you are curious uh, this Facebook page will help her social signs and especially when it comes to SEO we're offering a free I know it's short notice but a free SEO training live Google Plus event you can ask any question I encourage you to ask your questions sooner than later but you can sign up here by visiting Dan Moskal University it's at 3 o'clock Eastern Time on Sunday October 6 2013 and please ask your questions in advance if possible and you can also ask live questions I want to make sure everybody is fully uh, it all makes sense and we're staying together so let's go ahead and add create a page first and in the next video we're gonna put that Facebook comments uh, so you can add a, a comment using Facebook onto our website but let's do this first so she would be a local business is what we're gonna choose I think you can probably choose anything you'd like to work with. We'll go ahead and say professional services, business or place name. We'll say Jolie Moskal Therapist in Cologne. We'll just say uh, we'll say mental. We'll say mental health therapist. Not sure what her address is, but as I'm sure you're probably aware, uh, your social signals influence your rankings when it comes to search engine optimization. And if you'd like to see some more about the work we've done for her site. Uh, check out some other Dan Moskal YouTube videos. Uh, we've also got a couple books we've published including the 10 golden steps to shower in search engine sh and traffic. <clears throat> it's available on Amazon, the Kindle, and it should be available here on iTunes here any moment, any day. It may even be available today. Along with the audio version of it that might take a little bit longer so here we go let's get started <laughs> okay so add categories a description and a website to improve the ranking of your page in search so the idea is when people search Jolie Moskal they will find her Facebook page in a perfect world probably number two number three number four along with here's her Google Plus page I believe that's her page it might be her profile but we can move these healthgrades.com and other websites kind of out of the way here's one of her YouTube videos here's a yellow page a super page so let's just get a general idea Jolie Moskal here's a mental health counselor in Columbia South Carolina she has the first listing this is really kind of the second and then healthgrades.com has three and four and then Google Plus but that's a Jolie Moskal website has five third age has six images for Jolie Moskal has seven her YouTube video mental health therapist in Columbia South Carolina has eight and then yellow pages has nine super pages has ten so we can really get these other websites for the most part off of this front page so she controls most of the information at least on page one that people will read about her which I encourage you to do um, there's nothing wrong with that at all it's just being smart and uh, anyways let's get back to our page getting off track here add categories a description and a website to improve your ranking of your page and search categories so we'll say mental health counselor counseling and mental health perfect 
a description with basic info for Jolie Moskal. Jolie Moskal is a mental health therapist, counselor, counselor serving the local Columbia, South Carolina area. Local Columbia, South Carolina and surrounding areas. Areas. Website. So this is this is a cool little thing. We get to do a website. And this is going to provide an inbound link from Facebook over to Jolie Moskal's website. And if that doesn't make sense, just watch. She's a unique Facebook web address to make it easier for people to find your page. Once this is set, it can't be changed. We're going to just write Jolie Moskal. Is Jolie Moskal Mental Health Therapist a real establishment, business, or venue? Yes. Will Jolie Moscow Mental Health Therapist be the authorized and official representation of this establishment, business, or venue on Facebook? Yes, she will. Save info. Web address not available. I wonder if that's the Facebook web address. Jolie Moscow page. Let's try that. There we go. So, profile picture. We're just going to skip this. You know how to upload a picture onto Facebook. But that is the same exact way. And then add to favorites, newsfeed. Add your page to your favorites to easily access it anytime. We'll go ahead and add it to favorites. Click next. Reach more people. Advertise on Facebook to raise awareness about your business and get more people to like your page. On a totally side note, and I'm not sure how accurate this is, I was informed, though, via an intelligent marketer who's been at it for a long, long time, that only 16% of your business page Facebook posts are actually shared with the people that are following you. Only 16%, and that from my understanding and from what I was told was a way for Facebook to increase their advertising because if you want to pay them then they'll distribute it to more and show it to more folks. Uh, I'm not sure if that's 100% right but that's just what I've heard and it makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, one of the things that Facebook's changed even was where you see like the news feed, the news feed for personal profiles only. You obviously have a pages feed now where you can look at different pages. Uh, before, if you, if I remember right, you could get the pages information along with your personal friends. Like it all came in the same package, same news feed. Uh, so this is what we're going to do. These are Jolie's friends and that's part of the reason why you should have your friends and stuff or one of the reasons why it's good to use your personal profile rather. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just share her her website. We're just going to put it on here and just do a link to it. Uh, that'll just be our first post. And One of the things I personally like to do is copy the headline just like that and then I also like to copy the description. That's just me. I'm you know, you do what you think's best. I, I think the idea is just to make sure that you have, especially when it comes to SEO, is just to make sure that you have a social presence. Like you have a couple people that have liked or seen your page, and, and the more posts you make, the more likelihood. I'm st I'm not 100% sure all the ins and outs of Facebook just yet. Uh, I probably won't ever be. If you know some some details and some effective uh, things, I don't know why this is taking a minute. Uh, the last side note I have to make is I believe you have to make a couple of posts before your Facebook page really becomes live. I think this may even be unpublished as of today uh, before it'll really be live in the search engines. There's, there's obviously some weird ins and outs with everything you use, but I'm trying to post this. <laughs> Okay, and I believe her website is going to be under the about 
uh, section. If you have any specific questions or concerns, please leave a comment below. I'm happy and I'm here to help. Uh, please come and visit Dan Moskal University. We're currently offering a free email marketing strategy guide and we also have this live SEO training on Sunday. It's with Google Plus Hangouts, which is one of the coolest technologies I've seen in a long, long time. Uh, it's awesome, but we can all communicate and share everything we have with one another instantly, which is really, really, really cool. Uh, but please send your questions in because I want to have a uh, guideline. I've got a couple questions I'm going to answer first, second, and third so far, and I want to answer your question and give you, you know, what I know and what I can share. So uh, please, it's Sunday, 3 p.m., October 6, 2013. That's 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I know that's cutting into football, but that's just part of paying the price, like Earl Nightingale says. 3 p.m. Sunday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time, Sunday, October 6, 2013. Visit Dan Moskal University, sign up free, and let me know what I can help you with, because I promise you have some valuable information, uh, some valuable services, just like Jolie Moskal, to share with the rest of the world. Let me help you with what I know, so you can help others with what you know. And... Uh, will make the world a little bit better place. So again, this is Dan Moskal. Please comment below, leave any specific questions, concerns. Please share this video with your friends, family, and colleagues. And please attend this live training event where sharing with a uh, new business partner who's a newbie and we want to show him all the things that it's taken us since 2006 to learn and develop and practice at. So uh, thanks for watching. Look forward to seeing you Sunday. Have a great afternoon.